Hello friends, subscribe and follow us on our social media. And remember, you can also watch this video in Spanish on our other channel, Mundo Divertido de Niños. Find the link in the description of this video. Hello, curious minds. Today we will explore what makes everything around us so unique. Let's learn about the materials with which all things are made and their properties. Welcome to the fun world for kids! Materials are useful substances that help us make or manufacture something. Look or imagine your favorite toy and now think about the fantastic journey that the materials with which it is made have taken. How interesting, right? Or how about your sweater? What makes it so warm and soft? Let's find out. The first thing you should know is that the materials can be of two types, natural or artificial. Natural materials, as their name indicates, are obtained from nature and are called natural raw materials. Like stones, sand, cotton, or wood. These raw materials, depending on where they are obtained, can be of plant origin, of animal origin, or mineral origin. Raw materials of natural origin are obtained from plants, such as cotton, cereals, or wood. Those of animal origin are obtained from animals, such as leather, wool, or silk. And those of mineral origin are obtained from minerals and rocks, such as clay, marble, or iron. Artificial materials. They are those created by human beings. And they are born from the transformation of natural materials, like glass, which is made with minerals, plastics that are made with petroleum and cardboard, or the fabric of this beautiful dress is made by transforming caterpillar silk. Here comes my fun fact. Did you know that the paper is made of wood? What? Yes, to obtain the paper, cellulose fibers are used, obtained from crushed wood, which is combined with water and other chemicals to then be smoothed and turned into paper to create a thousand stories. Did you know that materials can be soft, hard, flexible, or even elastic. Let's find out more about its interesting properties. Material properties. The materials have characteristics that make them special. Some are heavy, some are light, some are smooth, and some are rough. These characteristics make the material behave in a certain way when faced with external stimuli such as light, heat, and forces among others. Some of these properties are the flexibility of this balloon that inflates, the hardness of this baseball bat, the transparency of this jar, or the thermal insulation of this pot that resists and resists heat and does not melt. The plasticity of this cookie dough that I can mold to create this tree, or the fragility of this vase that mom loves and that now is broken or the waterproofness of my camping tent that does not allow us to get wet when it rains. How interesting, right? Now it's your turn to think like little scientists. What materials do you find in your house? And how would you describe them to your parents? Hmm. I assure you that it is super fun and you will learn a lot. 
Bye bye. Thank you for watching our video. Did you like what you learned? Subscribe and find many more videos so you can learn while having fun. You can also watch this video in Spanish on our channel Mundo Divertido de Niños. The link is in the description. Lots of love. Bye bye.